has had a good couple games in a row. Yeah, he has. He, had, he played a solid floor game, I thought. Four assists, no turnovers, only took one shot. I think where he's got to lock in is at the defensive end, keeping Jackson from getting to the hand side and never really got going. He addressed the team after the game. It's a senior move, 50-year senior move, addressed the team, talking about leadership and himself getting going. Nice dump down pass there. In that's all Tuesday night here on ESPNU. Reed launching. And yeah, that one rattles home. Lucky, I've been to three Super Bowls. I can't believe the price of tickets. Oh, man. Unbelievable. Giants are going to win, though. I don't want to break your heart. I think you're right. Points for a team that is fairly high octane offensively. Dawson into Hummel. <laughs> 12 and 2 in the Big 12. The last loss for Kansas was at Missouri. Kansas goes to Texas A&M Wednesday. Missouri will host a very dangerous Kansas State team as Robbie Hummel out of. This may go up. You always know, don't you? It's just a team that I think a lot of us thought could have been a number one seed. No, no question about it. And, uh, you know, Mike did a terrific job with this group, had a key injury coming in, and Ryan Kelly, we saw it affected him in the ACC. Get them rolling, got them believing in themselves to win at Hinkle Fieldhouse. No team has ever won the regular season championship after losing its opener, and that went true to form. And that goes all the way back to almost the beginning of this century. Who's your nation behind their bench? It's a matchup of one of the best field goal percentage teams in the country, and VCU shoots it at only 41%. They're going to rely on their defense. VCU leads the country in steals. They're number three in forcing turnovers. Wow. 